Hey, what's up guys? This is an uh, update on my home theater. I don't know if, um, if you guys saw my first videos, but uh, just got a couple updates. It's been a while since I filmed a uh, video of my home theater, so I just kind of want to do an update so you guys can see what has been upgraded. Well, first of all, I'm still running my uh, home theater direct speakers up front subwoofer center channel left channel as you notice uh, any new upgrades I got is a uh, I got some of these foam acoustics it's pretty cool let me uh, zoom out of there Got some new posters here. The one back there. I got these foam acoustics at Guitar Center. I put a um, bass traps up here on top, both corners and in the rears. There you go. Um, oh, and I did the door. I used to get a lot of rattle in the room, so now it's it does um, flatten out the room a lot, so you get good acoustic sounds. Right now you're probably hearing my fan right there. I'm running XPMC now, so we'll go to the equipment rack. I'm just kind of doing a brief um, rundown. Cause I don't um, I don't know that much about this equipment. <laughs> uh, I got the Samson Blu-ray player. I don't really use that that much. I still got the Monster Power, the HTS 2600 power power condent um, cleaner. I'm still running the Denim, the AVR 1610. It's the same one. I have an upgrade. Oh, I did get an upgrade down here um, I don't think you can see it you can see the lights but it's a HTD amp it's a preamp uh, you can barely see it in there but what this does is now with my upgrade I'm running a, um, a 7.1 so up here in the back you'll see the home the uh, not the home theater the poke audio I had those up and the up here in these channels yeah so now I got these ones I bought some more I bought the rear one rear but then I decided well I might as well make it a 7.1 and get the whole effect so I ran the 7.1 and just got me an amplifier I took out the second Xbox and I just put that in in place it's 200 watt amp it's the A, you can't see it, A 2050. And I got some, I, I got some new external hard drives here. I got 246 terabytes plus the two inside here. And I got me a um, Core i5. Core i5 Windows 7 running XBMC. And I put a curtain in the back so it kind of makes it look clean. As you can see, the curtain. Whoa. And that's pretty much about it. Oh, I got a um, popcorn machine. Just basic popcorn machine I got on the Amazon for like 150 or so. It's pretty cool. It's kind of dirty right now. I just made some popcorn. Oh, and I got a home theater seat. Before, I just had a couch. So what I did is I add a couch and I add three seats in the back. And you see my projector up there. And from before, you saw me. Oh, you saw me running this remote, the Logitech, <clears throat> which is an awesome remote. But now I upgraded. So I could sit down here, and I got this bad boy. 
And this is runs. It's a little tablet. It's a Samsung. The Samsung Galaxy 7.7.1, 7 I guess. 7 7 inch. And let me show you this. This is pretty cool. So, anyways, you can pull up the app right here, the XBMC app, and you got your just um, different fonts on your screen, just kind of on standby. And as soon as I hit, uh, let me see if you can hear, see here, I hit um, movies. Oh, those are my TV shows. Well, you, I show TV shows. Okay, so here goes all the TV shows. Pretty cool. And let's just say, for example, I want to watch some Band of Brothers. Click on that. And it should come up. It says season one, which where there was only one season, so you just tap that. And it gives you all the episodes here. Days of Days, Quarantine, and then Cartan. Just tap that. Gives you a brief description of the the thing and at the bottom I don't know if you can see it but it says well it's not it says play now play episode tap that and then it's, now it's playing Band's Brothers and you look up here Band of Brothers here pretty awesome let me dim the lights I could do that all from here, from my my app here. Dim the lights a little bit. All right. Okay, hit stop. Go back and let's go to movies. And I just hit movies here, and it loads up all my movies. As you can see, you could just run on here. Movies, 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 and I don't know. All all these are on my server. So let's just pick a movie. Bam. There goes a movie at the bottom. You can play movie or play trailer. I'll select movie. Now playing. There it is. Awesome. <laughs> Alright, I'll go ahead and stop that. And this is the actual remote. You can actually configure everything right here. Like if you want to just go through the different settings, you could just so you go through the different settings here. Pretty cool, you got your video. And then also goes with music. Uh, you can't focus in here trying to hurry up because I don't want the video to end but hit music and all your music comes up and you can just play I don't know just play some freaking music here <laughs> Okay, let me lower it down. And same thing goes awesome. Just play music. And that's it. That's all I got for now. But that's my update on my home theater. Got a little tablet. Oh, you can watch YouTube videos too, man. I got to show you that real quick. So you can go to YouTube here. This is cool. And I'll just go to my account. And... Uh, my upload videos. I slide this to the side here. Bam. Okay, come on. Takes a little while. Okay, here goes my videos. Okay, and we could go back to my my first video here that I had up. And instead of watching it here on the tab. See, I can watch the video here, but then what I'll do is I'll just go ahead and transfer it to my XBMC. And then you can watch it there. 
I know, it'll come up here. Okay, what's up guys? There it is, YouTube. Okay, well I gotta go, see you guys later.